The North Central women's triathlon team had a very successful season, as has become the norm in the team's six-year existence. For all the accolades and victories over the last few months, it was all building up to nationals in Tempe, Arizona, where the Cardinals hoped to win their fourth straight Division III national title. Unfortunately, it wasn't to be. But the Cardinals still topped the podium as freshman Haley Poe captured the individual national title with a time of one hour, 12 minutes, and one second, an impressive 55 seconds ahead of her nearest competitor. I really felt like I was in the zone during that race. Um, it was the best mentally prepared I have ever been for a race. We did so much as a team to make sure that we knew the course really well, um, just like visualization activities and um, practicing on the course the two days leading up to the race. So even though I had never raced on the course in Arizona before, I felt like while I was racing on it, I knew it better than any course I had ever raced on before. I knew I gave that race everything that I had, so it was an amazing feeling to finish in first. Um, I had my whole family there at the race, so I had their support the whole time, and just to hear them on the course cheering for me was awesome because I hadn't heard their voices for a few months now. Um, and then also just being able to finish and watch my teammates come into the shoot after me was an awesome feeling. I was laying on the ground after, really wiped out, but seeing Ani after the race and just watching her finish and then come up to me right away, that's like the epitome of an, an amazing team and that support that we have for each other. So her support after the race really helped me as well as all of the other girls. Senior Annika Kotner also made the podium with a third place finish. That wouldn't have been a surprise before the race, but a crash during the biking portion required an incredible effort by Kotner in her final collegiate race to sprint to the finish with a time of one hour, 13 minutes, and 42 seconds. I don't think I necessarily realized the extent of pain that I probably was in, but I was a little angry, I guess, that I had crashed. So I got back on really quickly. My seat had totally taken a 90 degree turn. Um, it was pushing my seat back into place and doing the best I could to finish up the bike and get on the run. And the run's my favorite part. So luckily that's what I had left. She's an amazing cyclist. I'm so proud of her for all of her hard work during that race, especially after crashing. So once I found out that she crashed and still had that amazing race, just to have her up on the podium there with me was a feeling that's und undescribable. While they of course would have liked to win as a team, it was fitting for the senior and the freshman who train together and have been trading race victories back and forth all season to be side by side at the top when all was said and done. That was amazing. Ani has been my training partner through the whole season and she's pushed me in so many aspects of training, especially in the bike. Haley had an awesome race. It's been super fun training with her, racing with her, super rewarding to kind of finish this season together. I want to repeat national champion as much as I can, um, but also my goal in the future is to have two teammates up on the podium with me. So um, two girls from North Central, all three of us sharing that podium together would be epic. So if we could build up the program like that, that would be amazing. Connor hopes she's done everything she can to help this team succeed in the future, while Poe is determined to find ways to continue to improve and excel with a national championship already under her belt. I guess I haven't totally let it sink in that it's over um, from at least my collegiate career, but this sport and this team has given me so many opportunities. We've tra traveled all over the United States. Um, the relationships that you make with the team and the coaches are relationships that last forever. It's been an awesome opportunity. Hopefully I've left um, a good foundation of what it's like to be a leader on this team. I think all of the girls have really good leadership skills as is. Um, they all work really hard. I think it's sort of the foundation that um, Coach Garrison and Coach Kurt have set up for this team, that we work hard and we all show good leadership skills. And I don't doubt that those girls won't continue to do so, so that they can come back and win another national title. All of the girls on the team are super dedicated and hardworking to our craft. 
So I think our placement at Nationals this year has given us an even bigger boost to want to excel next year. And we have some great recruits coming in next year that will help shape this program even more. So I'm excited for them to join in in our team dynamic and really help us. Um, but the girls that we had this year did an excellent job and I think they're going to excel even more next year. Um, we're all great friends and we all inspire each other in everything that we do. So I think that we are even more motivated to go out and win by a ton next year.